South Korea's Yonhap News Agency reports that the DPRK has fired a short-range missile from the east coast city of Wonsan. South Korean and U.S. authorities are reportedly analyzing the details of the launch. For more on that, let's cross live to our correspondent Jack Barton in Seoul. Now, Jack, it, currently it seems to be a single-source story. Do you have more details from South Korean government regarding uh, this possible launch? Yeah, the Joint Chiefs, Chiefs of Staff sorry, have been uh, giving updates on this launch and it now appears that it was multiple missiles that were fired between 9.06 um, and 9.27. We don't know how many, but they flew for a range of 70 to 100 kilometres, heading northeast from the coastal resort town, the east coast coastal re resort town of Wonsan in the DPRK. Uh, they're still, they say they're still analyzing exactly what kind of weapons these were. There is probably a small possibility they might be battlefield rockets, in which case the diplomatic impact wouldn't be so bad. Uh, but 70 to 100 kilometers, the indications here are they are likely to be missiles. And if that is the case, this is clearly a test of the diplomacy because Kim Jong-un had promised no missile tests as long as the diplomacy was ongoing. Now, analysts already will be asking here, you know, what does Kim Jong-un want with this test? Is it to push towards the six-party talks, the resumption of those talks, as he recently discussed with Vladimir Putin? Or is it an attempt to get the stalled diplomacy back on track with the United States? Uh, a lot of helicopters have been flying overhead. Uh, Osan is to the south of where I am, into central Seoul. Uh, we've seen a lot of helicopter activity this morning. So we know emergency meetings are going on between government and uh, government officials and defense officials. Uh, still waiting to see, though, what kind of reaction will come from this test and also a full assessment of what exactly was tested.